Rev Smiler Spice Reconnect Retreat. Now, last year, God placed it on our heart to do a retreat. And we 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 did. If it's one thing how Rev Smiler Spice works is we allow God to, to lead us. So whatever the Spirit says, we need to do. Now, last year, the um, it was a very busy time for us. It was a very busy time. And um, we weren't sure, but God said, you need to do a retreat. Sometimes our head is hard, you know. Sometimes our head is hard because yeah, yeah. He'd, be telling <laughs> what, he'd be saying that for years. To be fair, yes. last year should yes. have been the year we did it. It should have been years before, to be fair. But it got to that stage where we're, we're still working on 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 our timing on just following god but we just felt last year we could fit it in anyway we did it last year we pulled out all the stops and we 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 had a retreat last year 50 ladies went away on retreat for about four days i think it was four days where it was about reconnecting to god it was where we 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 went through and demonstrated what time would be like spent with God and how you can do that in your life. And those 50 women, we've got a few testimonies. We'll send out the links and what have you so that you guys could see it again. The testimonies of the women that attended and what it did for them, how they encountered God and how it gave them the necessary um, information about how they can, how when they time carve out time for God, what that means for them in their life. And they were able to go home <clears throat> and take that with them. So we thank God for that. So, well, this year, I don't know what God is doing, but God has placed upon our heart that we need to do this again. And he has placed a bigger scale on us now. So we, we are believing and expecting to double the numbers we are going for five days monday to friday 21st to the 25th of august 2023 the 21st to the 25th now this year this year i'll be totally honest with you we wasn't sure what theme god was going to go with and we know because we know how god works with us and he would give it to us well He's, a, he's given us, he's started to give us what is going to happen and what he wants us to do at this conference. And not only has he given us the vision, he's also giving us the spiritual giftings needed in order for us to put on this retreat. And at this retreat, what you receive i and i just boy everyone who signs up to this retreat i just i'm excited for you mm. because you will receive deliverance you will see prophecy you will receive healing at this mm. conference yeah. on a scale and a level that has never well, on a scale at a level that we have, we have not experienced before. Let me cut you. Let me cut you. Yeah, let me cut. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Sorry. She, she's saying that very gentle, people. She's saying this too gentle for me. She's <laughs> <laughs> too gentle. Too gentle. She's there very, very slow and gentle. So let me just cut her there. Yeah? First of all, let me just go to, because you have two verses that's coming mm -hmm. from the people's verses. So, Kells said, she said Psalms 20 verse 7, she says, some trust in chariots and some in horses, but we trust in the name of the Lord God. Amen. Amen. And we're going to come to that as I speak about the retreat. Amen. Amen. And then Patrice's, and I knew what your one was, Patrice. I'll put it up there for you. Was right, for I know the plans I have for you, says mm -hmm. the Lord. They are plans for good, not for disaster, to give you a future and a hope. And with that, I'm going to say this, yeah. When you come on this retreat, people, yeah, this is not about me and Anthea, first of all. This is not about, oh, let's try to see how many women we can get here. 
this is about like we told you our passion is to reconcile you back to god and god has placed on our hearts people that when you come this year, i've said to Alfie as well i'm not just calling this a retreat i'm calling this a retreat conference yeah because i believe god wants as many women to be there to be touched by his holy spirit people i'm telling you now and this is why i'm excited this is why i stopped so i'm excited we are so excited for you because god has already been speaking to us and saying as Anthony said we are bringing he there's going to be a transformation in your life last year it was all about bringing people closer to god and teaching mm -hmm. people how to mm -hmm. do that and we will continue to do that that's what we're all about as we've just talked all about that just a minute ago but when you get to our retreat conference this year, people, understand you're going to have a transformation in your life. God wants to hit you with healing. As Anthea said, we're going to give you prophecy. That's something new. Trust me, that's something new for me and Anthea. When I tell you that God's placed something on the heart, we're like, what? I don't know about that. But now we're just on it, people. Because God has been speaking to us, like I said, through Lent. And so now we're coming, people, healing, prophecy. Understand he wants to give you the revelations in your life. And you can only receive it, people. I mean, you can receive it by yourself. We're not saying you can't receive it by yourself. But this particular retreat is going to be something that you've never seen before. We're excited. We don't know the whole picture, people, as Anthea said. We, we always get, as it gets closer and closer, God starts to reveal more. But what he has always trained me and Anthea to do is to trust him. And when we did that first retreat, we had no idea. We just went, oh, let's just do 50 people and see how we go. God gave us the 50 people. So now we're get, getting higher people and we're trusting in the Lord. So I would say to you people, please, please come on this retreat. It's going to change your life and there's going to be a transformation in your life. Please tell your family and friends. I wouldn't want you to miss it. For those of you who have been before, you knew what it was like. God wants to give you more so that when you leave, you're not going to go back and then you're going to forget everything that happened to you. You're going to see the hope in your life. That's what I wanted to say. Just to bring it to some, you know. <laughs> That's what, what it's going to be. What you will see at that retreat is the impossible. That God yes. is going to show up at that retreat. What you're believing for, you will see the impossible happen in your life. Amen. You will Amen. leave totally different to how you came. So if you're if you're in a stage in your life where you're questioning, you're asked, you're wondering why things are happening, why you're going through all of this, why is there the challenge? If you've got struggles, if you feel blocked, if you feel stagnant, if you feel as though things are against you, mm -hmm. and we know how the enemy works. The enemy has many soldiers, yeah? many soldiers, demons, and met more than one, legions occupying one person, tormenting them yes. with names like anger, depression, yes. suicide, death, hate. Yes. All of that, that's their name. That's their name because we one thing we're learning about recently as well is the strength of your name. What your name is has a lot of meaning. These demons have names and they reside within us. And what we have to do is be delivered from them. This retreat conference will free you, will clean you out of anything that is not of God. Amen. And you will return home changed, transformed, renewed in Jesus Christ. 
Amen. And Ermin's put a good verse for that, actually. Thank you, Ermin. You just says, Jesus called the weary to come. And that's what this retreat is all about. Come if you are weary, yeah? Come if you are weary. Because this is a retreat that's going to, you should be getting excited. Get excited. Get it within your spirit. Just like me, around Christmas time, like I said to you, God spoke to me. And he said to me, I know there's going to be changes in my life after these sort of 40 days after Lent. And I've just been getting excited. So I ask you, because August is quite a way. But say to yourself, yes, this is the place where I'm going to get even more. I'm going to be transformed. Where God is going to speak to me strongly about my life so please come you know we've got our, our sort of link as so have we got the um the email address where we've got the email, email is that the end of, we'll play the video at the end okay we'll so we'll play the video the at the end in terms of the price i mean it says on the, on, on there about 40 pounds that will maybe have to slightly change only because we've got fewer months but come and speak to me and ask you about about how you can pay there's Speak different ways you can pay that so don't yeah. don't let that be don't let that be like oh you know i can't come come and talk to us there's different ways cash you know check back but you know we'll work it out people we want as many we bring your friends to people tell your friends you know me and Amphia, yeah some of you you know are morning prayer and Amphia's analogies you know what you're like and we're gonna have fun at this retreat don't understand it's not just we're going to have some fun. We're going to mix it up a bit this year. We've got some things coming. You know, oh. you, know, you, know you know what okay. it's like. So those, of, those of you who came last year, you know Rev Smiler Spice, yeah? Mm -hmm. You know what you received. A lot of testimony about, oh, every day we got, yeah. There is gifts. There's free gifts. There's there, everything that you would need. Rev Smiler Spice will provide for you. So, but uh, we've got some God. Huh? God has given us some things this year. Yeah? I'm, 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 I'm excited for you all. Please just don't miss out, is all I can say. Sign up. We've got different themes, different aspects, different things going on this year. Come this year. Deliverance. Yes, Kels, there'll be deliverance. Yeah, amen. There will and be deliverance. And it will be, for, see, something for yourself. I know some of you have got busy lives, as we've just talked about, and some of you will have children, and I know that you have to sort that out. But say to your, see if you've got somebody that can look after the children and say, you know, I need to take some time out for myself. This is for me, and I feel that God's calling me to this place. This is something for you. Make the sacrifice. Make the sacrifice for Jesus to say, I'm going to do this for you that is what i would like to say to you today and alongside that i will say a lot of us you know when you look at the world today <laughs> as you all can see the devil is at work i'm afraid and mm -hmm. you need if you come you come come and bring your concerns your family your children bring them with you you can come and get deliverance for them yeah. because you're raising them up to god yeah. so when you come you come and you bring everything that you want to give to god and god the holy spirit will touch everything that you bring that you want to bring to god because He's a God of the impossible. Amen. When we bring it to him and place it to him in the atmosphere of where the spirit will be, because trust me, the spirit will be there, live, direct, and heavy. Yes. And when we enter that atmosphere of the spirit, Amen. understand that is when I will be calling for all of you to give everything you have, you are concerned about, up to God. And the spirit will resolve, deal, heal, deliver, rebuke everything that you give up in that space. Don't miss out, people, is all I can say. Don't hear about it and say, oh, I should have gone. Let me continue in my suffering and wait to the following year. Hmm. This Thank is your year. You. Yes, people. Yes. Yeah. You will come out of the suffering, come out 
of the condemnation come out of underneath what the lies of the enemy basically mm. you know get to the truth because the truth will set you free Amen. and as we come together as we come together in only how rev smile spice can do because god has has placed this upon our heart this is our calling in life and he's given us the necessary needs to be able to do this Amen. and so when you come what you will receive you will you will be transformed and we Amen. claim that in jesus Rev Smiler Spice presents Reconnect 2 Women's Retreat held next year, August 2023. Five-day residential retreat held at Yarnfield Park, Staffordshire. Ensuite accommodation, your own individual room. Wi-Fi free in all common areas and bedrooms. All-inclusive meals, breakfast, lunch and dinner. to gym and bar available on site. It includes coach travel to and from the retreat. All for £440, broken down into a £100 deposit payment, then four payments of £85 per month. Register now. Email reconnect.revsmilerspice at outlook.com. Dot com. Let me just pray. Dear Lord Jesus, I just uh, thank you that during this Lent season, you are drawing us nearer to you. And you're also looking at the different aspects of our character so that we can change. And Lord, so we're asking, Lord, as we continue through this Lent season, that you will fill us with your love and your peace and your presence and your love, Lord. And that you will begin just to start that deliverance, Lord, that we've just talked about. That all the things that are hurting us, all the things that are causing us pain, Lord Jesus, right now in the name of Jesus, Lord, that you will you will start to take that away lord we believe in healing we believe in prosperity we believe in your love right now we believe in all the miracles right now lord jesus and for those of us who may be doubting right now lord help us teach us train us in this season to take away that doubt and to believe in the impossible things lord you said that you can do the impossible because it's with you not us but with you to help us lord jesus not to go our own way but to go your way lord jesus fill us right now lord jesus with your holy spirit set us on fire lord jesus anoint us now lord right mm. now lord jesus anoint us right now sign yourself with the cross right now wherever you are just get sign yourself with the cross because jesus is anointing you now so as you continue in Lent, your eyes will, can be more opened and that your flesh and your soul could be more connected with the spirit so that you can hear from Jesus directly. Lord, I place it on everybody right now that they will start to hear from you. Any doubt that they have will be removed. Lord, we thank you in advance. We praise you in advance. We thank you for all that you've done for us in the past. And now we thank you for what you're doing in the present. And we believe for you and thank you for our futures. So we praise and thank you in the name of Jesus. Amen. 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 That's the email address. Kels has put up a good point here. She says, Amen. Break stuff off of my family for future generations. He Amen. is able. God Amen. is in the God of the generations. Amen. Understand that there are things we are going through because of our previous generations and what has happened and what is flowing down through the generations. You may be wondering why your family is going through certain things. It's generational. And yes. what we need to do is to break some of those generational things that are going on in our generations to cover our family. When you come to the retreat, all of those things will be broken. In the Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. 